Yesterday we paused to be aware of the bright field. Today we look not outwards, but inwards, as we consider a bright carnation in Rembrandt's Woman with a Pink, painted in the late 1660s. The capacity for silence, a deep, creative awareness of one's inner truth, is what distinguishes us as human. All of us, however ordinary or flawed, have at heart a seemingly boundless longing for fulfilment. And it is their consciousness of this that makes Rembrandt's portraits so beautiful. The woman with a pink is lost in the depths of her private reflections. Her dark background is symbolically unimportant, lending greater expression to the soft brightness that plays upon her face. Yesterday I was at an away day in which we were asked, what has our attention? We were told that Facebook asks itself, how could it get its users attention for as much time as possible? We were told that we live in a time of continued partial attention, that the average attention given to any one thing has been reduced in recent years from 12 seconds to eight. A goldfish's attention span is nine. Then the warning, what has your attention is the person you become. A warning or a blessing? For Rembrandt's woman, the pink in her hands is only the beginning of her awareness. Visibly silent, she is explicitly encountering the mystery of being human. She does not contemplate the carnation, usually an emblem of love, but looks within, in silence, quiet and engrossed. Help us, O oh Lord, when we look within, to find our fulfilment in the joy that you have for each one of us and your love, which is deep within us.